All right, so here we are, day two, uh, Jay Rich for David's um, barn. So got everything taped out yesterday, corner beaded, and all the no-code angles on upstairs, which you'll see in a second. And then today we just pre-filled everything with Sheetrock 90 to start the build up. And then we've gone back and skimmed everything over uh, with regular finishing compound mixed with a little bit of Sheetrock 90 in the mud just to try to help it dry because the drying conditions unfortunately in this garage barn are not the greatest. We do have two heaters going in here. Uh, the one upstairs is very hot but the one downstairs is not very warm and those big barn doors are not sealed the best so letting a lot of the heat out. So down here we put a lot of sheetrock 90 into our first coating mud and the reason is to help it set up so tomorrow it's not going to be dry enough to be able to pre-sand and start the finished coat. So what we will do to make our pre-sand easier when we do come back, and this is dry to pre-sand it, tomorrow we're just going to kind of wipe out the lips, these big lips, scrape them off, and then we're going to skim really tight over top with regular finishing compound, which will make it a lot easier for pre-sand when it is dry and ready for pre-sand. Hopefully two days from now we'll be able to pre-sand this. It's pretty chilly. So once we get upstairs, it's drying really good um, because the heat is being held up there very good. So if you see yesterday's video, none of this stuff was boarded yet or anything. So we came in this morning, we put, put the beads on right away, put the beads on right away, got this all pre-filled, taped, and then pre-filled, and then now it's all loaded with the first coat. First flat coat, ready to be pre-sanded and start finish coating from here. None of this stuff was on yesterday either. It all got boarded yesterday after we were done. So we've come back in, beaded it all, and loaded it all up, taped it all. So now we're up here, it's very warm. As you can see, it's drying really good already. It's drying like, nor like it normally does. So we've got everything loaded up here too. Pre-filled and then loaded. So tomorrow we'll be working on one side of the paper angles and then both sides of these no coat angles, getting them started to be finished coated. looks pretty sharp so tomorrow we're gonna work on that we have a plan for it again we didn't have the material here for it today so we'll deal with that tomorrow first thing I'm gonna grab something from home that I have and uh, we'll deal with it it's looking pretty sharp though but basically what's gonna happen up there is it's gonna be the exact same as that I just need something to put up there for backing so I can get the screws into it and then I'm gonna put an off angle, off angle, same thing, off angle, off angle. It's gonna make it look squared up and look really nice. And that's it. We care professional plastering services. We really do care. And I hope it shows in our work. Have a good day.